Welcome to We Win. From a crazy truck crash on a wet, treacherous road in Saskiers to a collision in Poland that led to a car splitting a lamppost in half, or a red car going off at 2.25 kmh, the dramatic incidents involving trucks and cars highlight the dangers of high-speed driving and the importance of road safety measures. Now, <laughs> let's get it on. Oh my god! Oh my god! It seems people forgot how to drive all of a sudden. A viral video as a photographer was covering a traffic accident. He caught another crash on camera. Yes, it did. Live, live. Oh my god. Oh. Stand by, stand by. A crazy truck crash on wet, treacherous road in Saskis. Please be more careful when driving in the rain. Now, let's watch it again in slow motion. Oh my god, he went off at 225 kmh in hydro pole. You know, being patient can save lives and prevent accidents. In a regrettable display of overconfidence, this driver foolishly decided to showcase his abilities in a manner that led to a disastrous outcome. Hope it's a valuable lesson for him. This is never a good choice for you to transport a broken car. Pay attention more on your road ahead. Never text message or live stream. Oh my god. Drinking and driving is illegal and causes many harms. Trap Province, Thailand, a truck crashed into a grocery store while pensioners sat on the front porch. CCTV footage captured the moment, but luckily, no serious injuries were reported, though the store's porch and nearby shops were damaged. If you find our videos help you drive better, please comment number one so we can make more videos. Thanks much. Now continue. Following a collision in Poland, two cars were significantly damaged. One car landed on the road, while the other collided with a lamppost, splitting it in half. Never make a sudden turn, will harm both you and others.
slow down at intersections. Being patient can save lives and prevent accidents. Please be careful. What happened with him? Can you guess? Please adherence to safety protocols on road. Learn to look in the rear view mirror while driving. I can tell with 1000% accuracy that many people were on their cell phone or radio instead of paying attention to the road. You should observe and prepare to brake from afar don't wait until the last minute to break suddenly. I can only say that it was a careless driver. Never do it. Haven't you followed our channel? Don't forget to subscribe to get more videos. Anyway, you should not drive through floods. Be careful. Oh my god. Just missed him. That guy's stuck. Wow. If you live in Cornwall and I sue that you are so used to reversing on country lanes now. Driving right your lane. Do not be careless like this. Driving is so insanely easy, but people like this makes it harder than it needs to. So sad. Tires must be checked carefully before driving. He fell asleep while driving. Thanks God, no one was hurt. Unbelievable, reading and driving. Do you think the perfect example of why autopilot is an especially bad idea? So dangerous. Thankfully, there was no collision. In this case, he should absolutely be slowing down. chase of police and those who violate traffic laws should never hope to escape from the police. An orange Dodge Charger flew by a Michigan State Police Trooper doing 120 mph on I-75 and it crashed into another car later. In a heart-stopping moment captured on camera. A freight train narrowly avoids colliding with a tractor trailer stuck on railroad tracks at Main Street. Prompt action by a passerby and a police sergeant saves the driver's life. The collision slices the trailer in half, leaving behind a tangled heap of titanium piping destined for a power plant. Look and listen for approaching trains to avoid accidents. A truck accident crashed a car into highway concrete, causing the car to almost break into pieces in Turkey. 
it was inexplicable that all the passengers and driver were intact. Thank God. If your vehicle stalls on the tracks, evacuate immediately and move away from the tracks to a safe location. One of the stupidest things drivers do is that they try to outrun an approaching train. Never do it. <coughs> Maintain your lane discipline and avoid weaving in and out of traffic. February 9, 2019, a derailment occurred involving a Reading Blue Mountain and Northern freight train in Nesca Honing. A stolen car careened through a Michigan neighborhood, hurtling toward a collision with a tree. The impact caused the vehicle to somersault multiple times, finally coming to a stop approximately six houses away. Is it instant karma? It occurred at the intersection of Taishan and Jinmin in Jinpi Township, Pingtung, China. If you find our videos help you drive better, please comment number one so we can make more videos. Thank you very much. Now, continue. Obey speed limits, wear seat belts, and avoid reckless driving. Oh my god. Driving is so insanely easy, but people like this make it harder than it needs to be. A car collided with a tree just across the street from Mansi's Steakhouse, igniting into flames later. A light car crashed into the block railroad crossing from the side. Luckily, the driver wasn't hurt. Please be careful. Understand the importance of maintaining distance and avoid waiting until the last moment to apply your brakes. A good neighbor happened to bump into a BMW in the parking while she was taking her car out. What would you do next time? <laughs> An ambulance collided with a careless driver who recklessly changed lanes. Look in the rearview mirror and observe carefully before changing lanes. The car lost its brakes and couldn't stop. The driver's steering is so impressive. Like the video, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to watch more amazing moments. Never brake check a truck. Obey the speed limits, folks. Remember that roads are for traveling, not for zigzagging. The 
the police should confiscate his driver's license. France Jules 63 faced charges of failure to control his vehicle after his Tesla Model 3 crashed into a convention center in Columbus, Ohio, as it was traveling at high speed. Do you think his brakes had failed, or something else was wrong with the Tesla? That's the difference between a driver and a steering wheel holder. Well done, driver. Ah, isn't that illegal? Please don't block intersections. In the UK, they've got yellow grid pattern markings in the middle of some junctions where you get fined if you stop on it. On Thursday, January 30th, an overdimensional load transporting equipment passed through Tamaqua. A lorry which hit trees after mounting a reservation on the Wolverhampton Ring Road caused delays in the city. <laughs> Glad the driver was okay. Fasten your seatbelts, please. Rough landing anticipated. Anyway, the driver was safe. Bless him. Garbage truck crashes into school bus and three cars on Long Island. Wonder if there was some actual computer or mechanical problem with the brakes. Be safe out there, folks. Don't drink and drive. My God, hope everyone's safe. Trees are strong. How about this car? Strong or not? Oh! Oh! Glad you're okay. This is a horrible incident from the rain, it looks like. Pickup truck rear end stop semi trailer at high rate of speed on I 90, north of Rochester, New York. After crossing the tracks, ensure there's enough room on the other side for your vehicle to completely clear the tracks before stopping. Familiarize yourself with railroad crossing locations along your route and plan ahead for safe navigation. Safety should always be the top priority when crossing railroad tracks, especially for drivers of long vehicles. Take your time, stay alert, and follow these guidelines to minimize the risk of accidents or collisions. Remember that never stop your vehicle on the railroad tracks. Slowing down when crossing the tracks is certain. Pay attention and control the speed appropriate to road conditions. Be careful on the roads and pay attention to the traffic situation.
A freight train derailed and caught fire in Canada near the city of Saskatoon. The moment of the accident was captured by a car's camera that had stopped at the barrier. Initially, the train cars wobbled before beginning to topple over. God was watching out for you. So thrilled to see all of you survive. If you find our videos help you drive better, please comment number one so we can make more videos. Thanks much. Now continue. Control the car in your lane well. If each of us were more careful on the road, these scenes would be gone. Always stay focused on the road ahead to avoid this. Please obey the speed on all roads, guys. Unbelievable. Never overtake like that. Remember, the streets are for cruising, not colliding. Did their eyes hurt, or did their car's rear-view mirror get stolen? The engine caught fire as the train moved slowly toward the station. Maybe it's overloaded after many hours of operation. The fact that if you are supposed to yield to oncoming traffic, then yield to oncoming traffic, even if that traffic is wrong. Like video, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to watch more amazing moments. Oh my god! Thanks God, he didn't sideswipe Santa Cruz right there. The truck made contact with the Toyota, nudging it forward in front of the larger vehicle along the M1 on the Gold Coast. That's why you should always obey speed limits on road. The dash cam footage captured a police officer pursuing a driver who was speeding at 140 mph in a BMW. He ended that very quickly. Good job. Oh no! Folks, I have an issue. Really? Was it an EV vehicle? Really? The North Texas Tollway Authority released a video depicting a truck colliding with a barrier wall along Highway 360 near Dallas-Fort Worth.
obey speed limits, wear seat belts, and avoid reckless driving. Oh no! The train tracks are not for any type of car or truck. Don't imitate this. A truck accelerated rapidly in the inner lane, but a few boards propped up couldn't withstand the force of the wind and fell onto the road. Maybe it does not like speed. Police and firefighters swiftly arrived to evacuate passengers and extinguish the fire. Thankfully, no injuries were reported. A driver in the outer lane accelerated while the truck overtook him so that he could not move back into the right lane and get stuck in the no overtaking section. In North Miami, a bright line train collided with an SUV, narrowly avoided by a family who escaped just in time. The incident, witnessed by bystanders, occurred at Northeast 141 Street and Biscayne. Always be alert to the tracks, even if you don't see any train in the distance. A train collided with a pickup truck stuck on tracks in Midland County. The incident occurred at Business I-20 in the West Industrial Area. The truck driver narrowly escaped seen running off screen before impact with no other injuries reported. Oh my God. In Alido, Texas near Fort Worth, a train derailed on Sunday after striking an 18-wheeler that had become lodged on the tracks. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. In West Texas, a tractor trailer became lodged on the tracks and was subsequently struck by a train which dragged it for half a mile before halting. The driver of the rig managed to exit the tractor mere minutes before the collision occurred on Wednesday morning in wow. Midland. Dramatic footage captured items from the flatbed trailer being flung high into the air as the intersection was shrouded in a cloud of dust. Damn, holy smokes. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Never try to outrun an approaching train or cross the tracks when the warning signals were active. The tow truck driver miraculously emerged unscathed after being struck by a train in Kansas. Bless him. Train hit semi truck in Marion, Ohio. Thankfully, the driver was safe. Always approach railroad crossings with caution, folks. Someone once told you that don't stop on the tracks is the same mentality as don't run from the police. What do you think about it?
video of a train derailment in Nesconi. If you find our videos help you drive better, please comment number one so we can make more videos. Thank you very much. Now, continue. And that's why you don't drive around the barriers. Never try it. A Brightline train collided with an SUV in Melbourne recently. Newly released video footage shows the SUV attempting to bypass safety measures at a railway crossing. This stresses the importance of railway safety awareness amid increased train traffic. car flips over in a shocking crash. Running a red light is horrible, but running a red light by that much time is absolutely appalling. People that drive like that should lose their driver's license for life. Following a dust storm crash downstate, mangled vehicles littered I-55. Remember, the streets are for cruising, not colliding. Please, don't emulate it. So terrible. Ensuring there's enough room for your vehicle as crossing trains road. Hey there, if you are enjoying my content, consider subscribing. You can always change your mind later. If there's two sets of tracks, well, there are two trains. Never assume it's safe to cross double R tracks. And that's why they tell you to be cautious and stop at railroad crossings. Emergency or not. Oh my god. SUV collides with seeding truck in Medfield by high speed. A car rear ends a learner driver on the A491 near the Red House Glass Cone in Wordsley. The impact sends the learner spinning before. Wow! Obey speed wow, limit, please. Yeah, it seems very funny, but don't imitate him. You are high cool!
And this is the bad result when you forget the handbrake. Don't ever be so absent-minded. It endangers others. In North Carolina, a driver who ran a stop sign caused a dump truck to crash directly into the side of a brick house. An unfortunate accident because the driver was absent-minded and crashed into the back of a small truck. Be patient, civilized and stay in your lane. Two semi-trucks crashed on I-80 near Joliet Thursday afternoon. The impact was so strong that the private car immediately reversed. The truck also rolled over, emitting smoke and leaving a brake mark several meters long. People need to be more aware when driving. The car crashed through the guardrail on the outside of the National Highway and rushed down the slope. It seems it disappeared after the crash. Winter driving is one big reason why. God bless all drivers out there and stay safe to return home. Jumping red lights is illegal. Never do it. Remember that never stop or park on railroad tracks, even momentarily. Be prepared to stop if necessary when approach all railroad crossings. Never try to win a train. An incredible video of a car flips over hitting multiple vehicles parked on Boston Street. Remember people, safe drive come first. Exercise caution at crossings with multiple tracks, as trains may be passing from different directions. Be mindful of large vehicles that may take longer to clear the tracks completely. If you're driving a large vehicle or towing a trailer, ensure you have enough clearance to safely cross the tracks. Strong winds on New Zealand's South Island knocked over a motorhome and pushed it across a highway and forcing nearby vehicles to swerve to avoid a collision. Here we go, here we go. If you find our videos help you drive better, please comment number one so we can make more videos. Thanks much. Now continue. Whoa, here we go. Never jump red light. Thank you for staying with us throughout this incredible journey. 
We'd love to hear which moment resonated with you the most. Please share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more captivating content. See you in the next video.